Zoom link. <laughs> Zoom link. I can't, you can't even yell it past me. I can. And I can do it all I want. It's all you do. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Wait, do you have fun staring at the wall? Yep. Right. Secret items. Okay, I know that up top is a refresher up here. Up, Second up, one? Up yes. top, yeah. No. And then that's a shop. No, that's the refresher, and that's the shop. <laughs> My bad. Every time I look at those, I just... Uh, I feel like the floor should just go up. But Instead of the ring coming down. It's the purpley thing that always yeah. shows me about it. Refreshed. Hmm. No. Do you like the tractor beam technology? Maybe that the purple ring is what triggers it. Hmm. Like it actually enables. Or or it keeps whatever's in there from in like there. Being pulling the part. <laughs> yeah, probably. And that's a shop. Yay! What's oh, a vending machine? I'm sorry. You only get one one whole lens. Um, by those, because Kratos whooped us a couple times. Thank you. Please come again. Yeah, these angels are soulless somehow. We never really touched on that point. Point number two, uh, but they still need shops. Yep. Yeah, no, th I think this is where we get lost because we're like, yeah. where do we even go? Because we need to go down, down the there. Road. Yep. To one of the thingies, but we never do it because you're just like, oh, we go here. This is obviously it. I'm like, you go. I, I can't. Oh, no, I don't. Wait, Lloyd, we should gather more information. And then I cut. Because <laughs> I was like, we're not. Yep. It's like 10 minutes of us <clears throat> just going back and forth, being like, where do we go? I know we run all the way back to the left, yeah. yeah. And, like, literally, you check that one and then don't yeah. even bother. Oh, is this one? Okay. Underneath the item shop. Ew. This seems to be the city's data bank. Oh, f there's a lot of reading in my oh, ahead of me. Professor, can you operate it? I'll try. Mm. Got it. Now we can get the data from this terminal. Lord help me. Dareth Carlon is protected by the force field emitted from the Eternal Sword. If this force field is removed, Dareth Carlon will be okay from and wander into space as a common. The world is split in two in order to keep the mana depletion to a minimum and to sustain the world the of the, and the seed of the giant tree. Additionally, the usage of the summon spirits to guard the mana link and restrict the flow keeps the world from prospering. Great prosperity leads to the possible development of magic technology, which causes meaningless wars. <sighs> then you got one more. The magic sword was given to the leader Idrasil when he formed the Pact with Origin. Its immense power is able to control time and space. It is said to be the source of, po source of the Lord, Lord leader, of Iggy's power. The leader Idrasil was able to split the world with the power of the Eternal Sword. If the sword were to be lost, the leader Idrasil's power would diminish, and while Gaia would surely face its doom as well. Ah! Well, hot damn. <laughs> I did that. That's some pretty mind-blowing stuff. We've mind obtained some very valuable information. Lloyd, we shouldn't stay here long. Let's hurry and get out of here. Yeah, let's go. I had to do that twice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> twice. I mean, technically, you've had to do all of this twice. I mean, yeah, definitely. <laughs> no. Oh. Munch, Darius, Carlon. No, we're no Gaia. Well, we're Gaia. Just above. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it looks like this is the emergency exit. Okay, let's go before they notice us. No, it looks like they already found us. So that's them! You're the ones that are pretending to be working for Lord Kratos. It's the chosen, the chosen of me, and it has escaped. Damn it. Let's just get out of here. Bob, we've told you about speaking. Your voice is not. Come on, scary. guys, I can be intimidating. No, thank you. I couldn't think of I'll the follow them. You report to Lord Udrazzle. Understood. You guys wanna get lunch? <laughs> Welcome to. Oh, fuck this part. Yeah! <laughs> Well, I mean, it's not so bad, but it's, it's fairly... So, one of the benefits for you guys of us losing our voice footage, or voiceover, for when we were playing through this, and us having to come back and watch us and voice over it again, is that you missed me yelling at Nigel about 7,000 times because he keeps going the wrong way, and B, me telling him where to go. So, you know. Wrong way is a... <laughs> I cut all those out too, but <laughs> I've already done it. <laughs> Fucking robots. <laughs> Those are one of the most annoying, well, one of the more annoying enemies in this freaking game. Robots. Yeah. <clears throat> well, it's just never a good pack of them. 
Like every time it is, it's like you do that oh, a lot too. Wait, what? <laughs> Did you? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, you get oh, it. God. They all work. They work in circles. Oh. Oh, I'm floating. So this is weightlessness. What's that? Well, on the ground, the mana from Gnome, Summon Spirit of Earth, gives rise to the effect known as gravity. The reason we fall to the ground from high places is because the Gnome's power pulls at us. But this place is so far away from the ground that Gnome's power doesn't reach. And so we float like this. He had an annoying attitude, but I guess Gnome's pretty important Summon Spirit. Be careful and move slowly. Once you start moving, you won't stop until you hit something. Woohoo! This is fun! Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'll be careful. <laughs> Six man coming through! Yeah, th this is far. You don't hear me going up, down, left, right for about five minutes. Yep. This is, yeah, okay, so right. Do it anyway, fuck okay. it. Down, left, up. Left, down. Left, up. Mm. Left, down. Looking at the stars. Maybe. No, not yet. Some point. Because you wanted to wait till we got out, and I was getting really mad about it. <laughs> left, up. Okay, you got it now. I wonder, how high up are we? We're inside the Tower of Salvation, after all. Are we higher than the clouds? We can see the stars around us. We have to be higher than the clouds. Oh, yeah. It's so strange. Normally looking at the stars when we feel safe, but now I feel scared. Don't worry. I'll protect you. I'll never let Crucius have you. Yeah, I'm not scared as long as you're with me. But you do make me cry. <laughs> Let's hurry back to the surface and get your illness cured. Yeah. Oh, she's still crystallizing. Yes. Up, left, down, left, up. It's much easier from this point. Oh, no, we gotta go to that door. Never mind. It's yeah. different. Empty silence. Upright. You're gonna do it, aren't you? Are you gonna do it, or are we gonna go upright? Thank I don't know. you. Oh, I did on the way out. Good. Are you okay, Prisea? You don't look well. My head is aching, and. And. I don't like it here. This empty, silent world. It feels like a world of death. I want to get back to the surface. Me too. Let's go back together to our world. Yes. In Brooklyn. In Brooklyn. You? Oh. <laughs> He'll never find us. Well, he got you anyway. So. Yep. Yeah. <clears throat> How could he find us? We were perfectly hidden. Oh, weightless. Yes. This weightless stuff is a little hard to handle. <laughs> Bob and all, no. Once you get used to it, it's pretty fun, Lloyd. Just imagine inviting a girl uh, you like up here. You could have all sorts of fun. Uh, uh, sort of, wait, you'd have fun. fun all sorts of ways that you could normally. Like what? Playing dag or something? <laughs> You're a really boring guy, Lloyd. He's just young and naive. He'll <laughs> learn eventually. <laughs> he likes Colette, we assume. <laughs> no, he likes all of us. Which is why he's just like, I don't get it. Playing tag? I'm confused. I don't know. He hasn't said that he'd protect <laughs> Zelos out of nowhere. Do I hit the big red button? Ra Rachel, tell me I get to hit the big red button. <laughs> Fine. Well, I don't uh, give a shit. not what we... Oh, well, apparently it was. <laughs> We're disengaging. Now it's green! Oh, God. Much gnome. Also, yeah, I like how they were like... Man, should we explain how gravity works? Fuck it. Uh, gnome Gnome spirit. does it. Yeah. <laughs> I this like is that. left down, left down, left down. Well, oh, so yeah. We don't have to make it to that up part Left yet. down, left down, left. I don't think that... Oh, that's an elevator, right? Yeah, because in that case, it would be left down, left up, right. Well, left down, left up, left up. Oh, that one. That yeah. one goes down. I was looking at the one Oh, these two right here also go somewhere. Actually, we kind of just skip through it when we get to them. 
Yeah, do 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 do. Whoa, God, it's done. You know what that reminds me of? Uh, the way we cut it. Um, in the. Oh. I'm sorry, no, no, go on. Oh, my no. B, my B. <laughs> no, 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 go on, go on. <laughs> You're the best. You're the. <laughs> You're the best. <laughs> We're a guard. Um, in uh, in the RPG. It's Colette. You want to give it to Colette? There you go. <laughs> Nice. Go on. Uh, in the RPG uh, Earthbound. Oh, ooh. when you can magically skip them. Or when you have, yeah, yeah, once once you're high enough level, if you're so far above it, like if you're the same level, it won't. But if you're higher level like high enough above level, mm -hmm. it'd go in and then would immediately end the battle and give you your EXP and if mm -hmm. there was any drops. <laughs> it's kinda like that. Just, yeah, done. Yeah, th this yeah. is just what it reminds me of. We're about to hit another one. Nice. <laughs> I'm just watching the cuts <laughs> in the editing software. <laughs> and you already know the future, Rachel. I know. And another one. You're gonna, you're gonna hit that guy. <laughs> you're gonna hit. No, I'm not. No, you're not. Not yet. That one you are though. Come back oh no, I I cut out the save. Never mind. That was flawless, though. That was like. A that was pretty good, yeah. It looks like you just stood there for a couple seconds and then... I keep... <laughs> You're trying to figure shit out. I don't know. No, no, no. I, I, I was just laughing at the... That was the, the red gate because there was red jewels on top of it. I get it now. Mmm. No, uh, I was it was pretty smooth. I didn't uh, really notice the transition. Yeah. That's like uh, oh, in the new James Bond film. There's this <laughs> really, really great... I'm glad I paused it right before. <laughs> you, you can have this... It makes you pretty. I mean, it doesn't, but... It's rude. Oh, and she was already pretty is what it's I'm getting at. Rude. She's already pretty. The dress don't make her pretty. Oh, okay. She pretty. All right. She wear the dress Relax. well. That, that's a good answer. Good job. You're damn right. <laughs> Put me on the board. <laughs> Put me on the board. <laughs> ten points for Nigel. Oh, wow. I didn't know I was going to get a full ten. Nice. All right, fine. Eight points No, for too Nigel. late. You need points <laughs> to give. <laughs> don't fucking wait for it. Listen. <laughs> No, eight points for Nigel. Nice. <laughs> you get purple. I'll get blue. Or no, I'll get green so that you can actually tell the difference. Because the blue and the purple kind of look similar. No, I'd imagine so. I'm going to wake up tomorrow and be like, why the fuck is there an eight why on my whiteboard? What does that mean? Uh, that's, a, that's a blast door. You got to hit A. I saw your uh, little Jolteon beforehand. <laughs> They're from uh, the Poké Center when they had the Eevee collection. Someone scanned the folders oh. and made foam wallpapers out of them. But they don't have the rest of them! Yeah, yeah. I think you, I I think you were yeah, telling me about, about this before. before. Yeah. I don't have Umbreon or Sylveon. Oh, no, they have Sylveon. It's Umbreon, Espeon, or Glaceon. Glaceon? Umbreon and Espeon. Glaceon, yeah. What and about Leafian? Leafian's here. Yeah. The Leafian. You know, we're... Really good commentary over this. Yeah, exactly. Shit they can't even see. What, what, what would be... So, um... Okay, well, keeping up with that, if you had to pick uh, out of the currently existing types, whoa, what uh, what kind of Eevee would you want next? Oh, like what one I'd want? Well, I'm, yeah, you get to pick a type. So, like... I have one. <laughs> yeah, you get to pick of the elements. Um, so Ghost or Dragon? Both pretty good. Hmm. I think personal preference, I'd want a steel type. That's just me. I don't know yeah. how they would do that. Um, second follow up would be poison. Mm, fair enough. I've seen uh, there was a really good fan rendition of a uh, like an albino. It was like an Eevee, but it was like yeah, yeah. all white with red eyes, and it had sores on its neck. But out of the sores was coming this mane of purple, like gas almost. Yeah. So like, kind of like normal Eevee looks with his weird puffy fur. fur. Yeah. But it was like all gas, and I'm like, oh, that actually looks really cool. Cause like, flying Eevee type. You yeah, got, it's kind of. Can't make him a cloud. Bug type. That's strange in general. No, you give the Eevee wings. Yeah, like like like. Dragonfly wings? No, like the ears are wings. <laughs> the ears are wings. Yeah. Ooh, I didn't think about that. Um, no, <laughs> uh, the ones I'm missing, the ones I didn't scan. Yes. Were Umbreon, Vaporeon, and Glaceon. Oh, no, Vaporeon. I know, it makes me really sad. That's strange. It's my favorite one. I lied. Flareon's my favorite, because... If I... Okay. Vaporeon... <laughs> no, no, this is the theory. Vaporeon is my favorite Eevee evolution, but if I ever had to get a plushie of one, I would get Flareon because of the fluff. It wouldn't be much fluff. Yes. I do. That makes sense. 
Because uh, I still have the, the Porion necklace and the portal to go with oh, your yeah. orange portal and uh, Umbreon. The Umbreon. I kind of I think it's kind of funny that I get the blue one to go with the Porion, and you know the orange one that goes really well with the black of uh, Umbreon. Halloween. Yeah. Much good. Isn't that your favorite holiday? Yep, for sure. Besides Arbor Day, but you know that's everyone's favorite. So what? <laughs> <laughs> Man, I can't come into work. <laughs> Man, are you going to work tomorrow? Man, are you can me fucking Arbor Day. I'm getting drunk. <laughs> me in the trees? Uh, you get three guesses as to what my favorite holiday is, and the first two don't count. Root beer. Um, yeah, actually. No, so I was <laughs> making a joke about drinking with trees. I, oh. <laughs> um, hi. Right. Uh, Christmas. Yeah. Yeah, done. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that one. Since the first two don't count, it's fucking obvious. <laughs> I should have. Damn, I should have guessed. Uh, pre- Valentine's Day. Day. <laughs> hey, it's coming up. Valentine's Day. Not to give context to the thing that it, you know what the best part is. Know this we, we can name. We can drop dates. Recent shit currently, now. Yeah. yeah. Because this is in out. the past. Well, this is this will come out in the future. Upload seventy one. Oh, laser blade. So 72, 73. That's interrupt train of thought. But laser blade just happened. Um, I think this is gonna come out directly before Valentine's Day. That's really <laughs> eerie. <laughs> let me let me check. Um, two. Doing three, quick math. Four, five, mm-hmm. six, seven. Yeah, this could come out around the fifth of February. Perfect. Well then, to. <laughs> All my Valentines being yeah. you people. <laughs> Oi. <laughs> Hush your mouth. <laughs> I can't even get through it. Oh, uh, yeah. You got me. You got. Yeah? No, oh, I can't. Yeah. Oh, that was good. <laughs> I'll figure it out. Um, you can cut out where we go. Oh, another one. Because obviously. <laughs> no, no, leave that in. Leave that Oh, God. That was two in a row. Sorry. I ran into two robots. Yeah, we're almost. You're almost done though. Dude, dude, thank God. One, two. Oh, I'm three. gonna hit this guy. Two more sure. cuts. Oh, no, nope. yeah. you're fine with this one too. You're much, fine for a long while. Much juke. Now. Well, we're about to do these. Yeah. What? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Down, left, up. Oh, there's another elevator there too. Yep. Yeah, that, oh, that's when you were talking about. I was talking about the one at the top, and then I thought you were talking about the yeah, one no, two I, on the bottom. I, the three you pointed out were the three I didn't know existed. Yeah, I was I only looking at the one. I'm pretty sure when we played this, I didn't notice that one existed either. That's really funny. Yep. Left and right. Examine. I don't know. Do we want to? I guess so. Do you have to? <laughs> Linger? Yeah. By the cranberries? There was something I was just editing, and it involved that. Do, do you have to? Did the word linger come? Yeah, from? Oh, okay. yeah, of that, course. That, that's that makes sense. What spark did that? Yeah, that's why you you were like, do you have to? Do you have to? And then I started singing it. Oh well, yeah, at that point. Okay. But so, now I don't remember what it was. Here's a quick question: Can you name any other cran- uh, cranberry song? No. Really? I didn't even know it was by the cranberries. I actually don't know. No, I'm pretty sure "Linger" by the cranberries. If I'm wrong, everyone can laugh at me. Well, um, we're about to find out. Pretty sure it came out in the 90s. He said tentatively. Oh, good. Oh. Yeah, it's by the cranberries. Oh, good. I see the only other song I can come up by the cranberries is that zombie song. But that zombie song. It's called Zombie. And the girl, you know the song because she goes, Zombie, Zombie, nope. Zombie. They're it's, Irish? Are they really? Sweet. Yeah, they're from uh, Limerick, in Ireland. Head, in your head, zombie. Yeah, okay. And thanks, cranberries. Uh, that's kind of funny. I said, I said 90s. Yeah. Nice to uh, mainstream success in the 90s. Good. Thanks, Wiki. <laughs> Making me feel like I know something. Mm. Welcome back to the Cranberry Podcast, uh, where we talk <laughs> about nothing but the fucking po- uh, cranberries. <laughs> Honestly, if Nigel and I ever started a podcast, we would start 
with the intent of talking about a subject that we picked beforehand, and by the time our hour was up, we would be on, like, a topic that was, like, 50,000 degrees away from it. We'd need... We would definitely need some sort of sheep herder to keep us on yeah. a goddamn track. Because <laughs> we go all... Like, I'm pretty sure we could be like, okay, we're going to talk about this for, like, five minutes, and that's the only idea we need because we're going to keep going for the rest of the hour. Mm-hmm.